Bhagavad Gita, text 2.67 Whichever of the roving senses the mind runs after, that sense carries away one's intelligence, just as the wind carries away a ship on water. This verse states that if the demands of even one of the senses is pursued, such pursuit steals away one's hopes for enlightenment. All commentators have understood it in this way. Accordingly, Yad in this verse has been rendered whichever. Whichever of the wandering senses the mind runs after, this one sense carries away one's intelligence. How much more is this the case if the mind runs after all of the senses? This understanding of the verse is further evidenced by the following verse in which Krishna says that only complete withdrawal of the senses brings about enlightenment. <laughs> 